What's up, guys? It's been a little while. I don't have much time left, but uh, I heard there was some drama going on within the Coffee Sour Strikes community. All right, somebody made a video revealing the truth. Someone else made a video revealing the truth, and a third person made a video revealing the truth. I have not seen these videos yet. Anyways, here's my take on the situation. So basically, if this has anything to do with the kids, it's Troubadour's fault. Troubadour, he, we told him not to. We really tried, and yet he just couldn't keep his hands off those kids. So that's all on him. Um, the image, uh, I did see the thumbnail. The image of that flight logs, I was just visiting. I can't speak on the rest of them. Um, what else could they have talked about? Uh, they were probably talking about the band kind of breaking up, right? Everyone's kind of posting to their own channel now, and no one's really posting to Coffee Source Rex besides CSR himself. That's also Troubadour's fault. The breakdown all happened when he joined the channel. He's really just a bad dude. Like, he doesn't even post, and he's causing issues. I, that's just him being a bad person. Anyways, if they probably also mentioned something about Uncle Jamal. Listen, man, that's what he gets for living in Alaska. The population's like five. Okay, well, the population now is like four. Um, but this dude was he, he was like a seven-foot-tall monster. It took like five meese to take him down. And I know that the CSR gets upset when people say meese, but like it took a lot of meese to take that man down. Uh, look, that's what he gets for living in Alaska, all right? There's like three things in Alaska, and one of those three things is meese. And one of those things that aren't in Alaska is Uncle Jamal anymore. Anyways, um, uh, what else could they have talked about? Um, probably talked about um, Jeg, um, Mr. Jeffrey Gibbons. Um, shit, I don't have time, guys. It's time for me to go. Peace out.